I want to say a few words now about a wonderful publisher, Wendy Pye. Wendy publishes the Sunshine Books and I have been working with Wendy for over 30 years. We met up in the 1960s when teachers in New Zealand were in dire need of new materials in their classrooms. Storybooks. Storybooks that had the quality of good picture books but that also taught children to read, helped children to learn the mechanics of reading. We started off in a small way. There was Wendy, June Melser, who was a reading teacher and had worked as an editor also, and Bruce Wallace, who was our art director. We had wonderful meetings together, which certainly appealed to the child in us. And we put together a collection of books, which we thought would go out to New Zealand teachers to help bridge the gap that they needed to fill in their classrooms. We didn't know that those books would go around the world and be read by millions of children in schools all over the globe. Sunshine Books was such an exciting project. We had learned so much about children, about their needs, about the classroom. We had learned so much from children themselves and all of that was going into the Sunshine Books. When Wendy asked me to do the Sunshine Books, I was very excited. By this stage I had knew so much about early reading and had worked for years with young children and with teachers, been into so many classrooms thanks to the hospitality of teachers and spent a long time listening to child language, revising the old hundred word lists that were handed out, the hundred basic words of language, revising them to child usage because I believe the original 100 words came from adult usage. So there I was, all set with the, uh, everything I needed to do these sunshine books.